Las Vegas Family Puppet Theater Company's mission is to inspire imagination, education, and community through the art of puppetry. We create entertaining and educational puppet shows to introduce the art of puppet making and performance to all. Made the base, kind of like build a bear, and now it's gonna come alive. <laughs> there we go. All right, so there we go. Just a bunch of hot glue. Put this in here. Wraps around. Alright, then what I'm gonna do on top here, I'm gonna glue this together to itself. So it just looks like it. cool here. Oscar's Icelandic cousin. <laughs> <laughs> See, that's gonna be an awesome eye you know, like that. It's already got a lot of expression for it. <laughs> okay, we'll do this one. You gotta make those noises. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like the fur on top of the eyes better, especially for the monsters. See, they're already <laughs> looking pretty awesome. Right at you, right? So I'm gonna decide how high up of a nose, how small of a nose we were talking that we wanted him a little bit angry. So when I do angry, I like to you know, his mouth to look almost like a frown, so I bring the eyes down a bit. So he's like that, meh, meh, <laughs> meh. So you see, whereas if he's up here, he looks like more, he's kind of more innocent looking, you know? Hi guys. You know, bring it down here. <laughs> you got that grouchy look, that meh. Stay out of my cave. All right, so, but do you like about that, about there? Yes. You feel that, okay. So I'm gonna make a little slit going across here. I'm gonna spread that out. I'm gonna put a bunch of hot glue there. And you're gonna put your hand inside the puppet for when you're squeezing the hot glue because you really wanna squeeze that down. So you put, I'm pushing up with my other hand, right? Okay. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna squeeze that fur then back around it. Puppetry is a good way to deliver information to people with special needs and help them to retain it and retell it. Benefits include development of language and social motor skills, the expression and understanding of emotions, self-confidence, and social interaction. Here it comes. Hello. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Are you a vegetarian? Oh, me? No. I am. I am a vegetarian. I don't know about this buzzer. Oh, no. Just meat for me. When we can find it. What do you think about that impossible meat? Well, yeah, if you can't find the real thing, I guess it's the best. I've tasted it. It's not right. Something's not right, man. Yeah, you got that right. That's that's true. <laughs> Yeah, I 
Heel lang, doe je? If you practice improv, you will learn to be present, changeable, fight well, be brave, play with difficult people, be authentic, funny, and healthy. Uh, Miss Kitty, yes? how do you serve your um, your sarsaparilla? Is it on the rocks? It's always bottled, always cold, and served with a smile. Okay. <laughs> I like the sarsaparilla float when she puts ice cream in it. Oh, that sounds good. And That's I my favorite. Love oh, raspberry pies. That's I was gonna give you some, but the cat keeps eating the ball. Mm. <laughs> I'm gonna get him. You watch. That's going to turn out great. Ah, sounds suspiciously like cheese for him. Yeah, I've heard of flu influence. Uh, who's that one guy from the Muppets too with the red hair? They say I sound like him. Okay, okay. <laughs> Beep, 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 beep. Yeah, what's the other guy? Oh man, they just wait, wait, wait. Wait. This is 3D. Wait. Pirates are the feelers, the doers, the actors. Robots are the thinkers, the analyzers, the writers. The ninjas are the ones who can do both and can do whatever is needed at any moment. All those days watching <laughs> There you go, yeah, come on over. All right, so I did one of these eyes that looks nice and sharp. Looks a little bit like a Pokeball. I don't mean for that to be that, but Let me get the one more eye here for you. I'm just basically cutting a little strip, thin little strip, wrapping it around. Yeah, we're going with the the cherry strawberry kind of theme with the with the birthday. So somewhere in there, whatever it might be. <laughs> Do some lines on the back here too. Captain Blue, I want you to meet my friend Ashley. Hi, Ashley. How are you doing today? Well, she doesn't really respond, but she can hear you really well. Oh, I get it. So she's cool. Yeah, she's pretty cool. Isn't she beautiful? Yeah, she's so beautiful. Hi, Ashley. When, when you're trying to communicate with someone that's nonverbal, mm -hmm. how do you think of ideas of what to talk about? Oh, well, I would, uh, the ideas, specific ideas, I'm not sure, it'll depend on the situation, but it's always try something new. You know, regardless of anyone's ability, the kids in my class, if, if you are not, we play, even in something as simple as charades, the idea is that you want to communicate with your audience non-verbally, and specifically in charades, and if that's not happening right away, then you got to make a different choice. Just try to communicate, it's you that has to make a different choice with who you're communicating with. It's not their problem, it's you. You make a different choice and try to communicate. So we learn that through acting games and improv games and, and charades, something as simple as charades. It matters how you use the game. It's not just passing time, play some charades. Use it, get better at communicating non-verbally. You know, that's what I, that's what I would say. 
Tell me about those story dice you're working with. Well, these story dice, these are just to encourage uh, imagination. Sometimes when you're in the moment and you're improvising, it's hard to think of that specific idea. So I'm gonna look at you and go, okay, name a historical figure. And you're like, humana, 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 humana. But as soon as you, you're not worried about it, you can Benjamin Franklin, George Washington, you can name a million of them. But sometimes when you're on the spot, you're like, ah, humana, humana, humana. Well, these are great for on the spot. The other day, I woke up and I decided to go for a walk and I couldn't believe it. I looked out my window and I saw a sailboat. And this was really strange because I, there, isn't a, there isn't an ocean for a hundred miles. What a strange thing to see a sailboat. And so I was like, you know what? I'm gonna get on that sailboat. And I got on that sailboat and on the sailboat, there was a king. The king was sitting on that sailboat waiting for me. Stuff like that. And then you just go with the story. Don't disagree with the dice. Yes and the dice, yes and. You know, a storm. Yes, and then it started to storm. And so the water started to rise and I sailed on that sailboat through the storm. <laughs> you know, and then, oh, it just kept on storming and storming and storming. You know what I mean? You, you don't say, oh, no, it didn't do that. You can't disagree with the dice. You yes and, you go with it. <laughs> and then I sat and ate some cheese and I had a wonderful day. Who doesn't <laughs> like ending their day with a big piece of cheese? <laughs> The stinkier, the better. <laughs> Puppets encourage kids to use their imagination and infuse a sense of play into story time. Come back and make a puppet! Yeah.